Without the sweater, guys. No, oh, look at yeah. Oh, I so regret not wearing my awesome sweater. We got you. Nice to see you guys. We got you this if you want to wear it. Oh, uh, there we go. I think I've got to wear it. Yeah. Yeah. Lovely. All right, first we're going to be very, uh, like a awkward family. Uh, uh, yes. Look where? So there you have it, the Prime Minister posing for a photo with the Generation Why Not. It was for their holiday greeting cards. And now we're going to talk to Matt Deher and Amar Kandil about their meeting with the Prime Minister. They join us now from Montreal. Good morning, guys. Uh, you know, Matt, i got to begin with you because you, you guys have a YouTube channel. It's called Generation Why Not. You put in these challenges that you set for yourself. And one of your challenges apparently has been to meet Justin Trudeau even before this Christmas card. Why is that? Well, he's someone who stands for, who endorses diversity and who believes uh, how, much of a, how much of a strong component this is to forming this nation and, and, and what makes this nation great. And we, he's, he's young, he's hustled so hard to get to where he is today, and that inspires us a lot. Uh, that's why ever since he got elected and ever since, um, like with all the great work he's been doing, we just decided that we, this is someone who we'd love to meet and would love to get to know personally. And... We also wanted to take an epic Christmas card, and I guess the most epic we could think of this year was just to go with Trudeau and, and pose with him for a card and have that be the most diverse Christmas card ever. People from five different countries, because uh, I'm from Egypt, Matt is from New York, uh, Thomas is from Paris, and Darren is from Turkey. And of course, Mr. Justin Trudeau is Canadian, so we thought that would be pretty epic for a photo. So, Matt, tell us about this meeting then. How did you make plans to meet up with the Prime Minister? So we, we emailed a bunch of people. We had no idea where he was going to be for a long time. Um, so we decided oh, sorry. Uh, so sorry. We decided that uh, we were just going to drive to Ottawa and we were going to put on these crazy Christmas sweaters and, uh, and just stand outside the town hall where he was giving a talk. So we were just standing there and people were coming up to us and asking us what we were doing there. And we explained we want to have this holiday cart with Justin Trudeau. Um, and then bit by bit, the security, then his staff came up to us and we were like, how can we help? Some of them had seen our Love Over Fear video that we made in the metro station. Uh, and we explained, this is ridiculous, but we really want to get this holiday card. Uh, and eventually it got to him. He heard about us. Uh, his staff was like, these guys are okay. They're, they're normal people. They're not crazy. Uh, and then we eventually got the picture. You know, if that was the prime minister calling, we would have waited for you to have a conversation with him, just so you know. <laughs> but Amar, I got to ask you because, as as Matt was saying, eventually people said, you know, these guys they're trustworthy. You don't have to worry about them. But were you surprised at Trudeau's reaction when he came out of the National Arts Center in Ottawa to greet you? Yeah, I mean, it was just uh, like the second he walked out and he acted surprised and just came approached us. And even when he when he came in for the handshake, it wasn't just the handshake. He came in for the handshake and he pulled us in for hugs, which just felt. We, we felt amazing, and uh, and even him like telling us at the end, uh, some part of the video he, t he tells us uh, he he was thanking us for all the great work we've been we've been doing for diversity, um, and that meant a lot to us because for him we recognize him for all the great things that have been that he's been doing, and for him to recognize us back for our work, whether it's uh, Love or Fear or any of the other videos that we made, uh, that just felt amazing for us. Okay, and listen, we're running out of time here, but Matt, before you go, this was more than just a photo. You've, you turned this photo into holiday cards with a reason. Tell us about that. So we, because of all the work Trudeau is doing for the refugees, we thought we'd help. So every card that we sell, it's $5 just on our website. Um, you can see it at the end of the video on our YouTube channel, Generation Why Not. Uh, every order gives back. We give back 100% of the proceeds to the Syrian Refugee Relief Fund. Um, and every $27,000 raised of that helps a family of four uh, establish itself in Canada. Um, and so we're just following in his footsteps. It's really not much. Like, we don't expect to get more than uh, a few hundred dollars worth of orders. But to us, it's our way of like, showing our support for Trudeau and what he's doing. Yeah, but for anyone who wants the card, it's hilarious. It will make you smile. Yeah, it's a very funny card. Okay, yeah, so okay. everyone should just order it, and we want to raise as much money as possible for the, for the refugee fund, for sure. Okay, guys, listen, I want to thank you for your time. We're running out of time, unfortunately. But as we go, he gave you a secret Denis Coderre handshake. Show us the handshake, the two of you, as we say thank you and happy holidays. <laughs> very nice. Take care, guys. Thanks. Easy, Michael. Thank you.